Hey guys, I'm Marines and uh, today we're going to show you how to make dual mags. I haven't made them yet, but um, for the uh, Pulse R76, this one, they're clear or black. Um, there's two ways to make dual mags, is there's just this way, like this, and there's also like this way or something. So whenever you take it out, you just twist it, and then put it in. But we're just gonna, today, this is just going to be the version 1. And we're going to show you how to make just of these. Okay, what you'll need is a pen, trusty Leatherman or knife or scissors, good old duct tape, and good old cardboard. Pretty decent sheet. Whatever. So you're going to want to take these, put one into the gun, alright, it's determined like where I put it down here, maybe about there, and then put the other one on, and because that's how much room right here is you're going to have to do it because you don't want it to stay on there because then you won't be able to take it out easy. You're going to have to want it to be floating quite a little bit, so do a couple sheets of cardboard to take the magazine out the gun aside until the end and now you're gonna get the cardboard take your best magazine and then you're gonna just put it like this um if it's a banana clip and then you're just gonna wanna trace out a little outline this is a little hard because it has this part but you can get out of there Ish. And if you're good, you can just. Okay. Not the best artist, but that will work. And then just put it over again and make sure it looks pretty good. Alright, gonna cut that out. Open your Leatherman and get to your big knife attachment. And cut her out. I'm just gonna do it out of the camera because it's gonna be faster. Almost have it out. <laughs> then once out, determine if it's good or not, just put it on here and it uh, looks pretty good. Alright. Now you're gonna wanna make about maybe two more of these. Um so yeah, let's make I think about two more would be good here. No, I don't even think. I'm gonna do one more just to be on the safe side. So get your cardboard again. I don't know where I put my pen. Oh, got it. And get your cut out and do another one. Okay. And guys, about the M4, I'm not going to get it until January. The surprise M4s, but. Because I'm getting a laptop. But that will be nice so I can do editing from my room. Okay, that's good. So now, let's want to cut it out. Okay. Oh, wait. Let's see here. is not cutting because it's on the edge. Okay, let me get this short first. Okay, 
No. Some cardboard. Cardboard these days, you know. There. I guess that's good. I'm gonna go get my scissors sometimes. I can just trim them up with those. Yep. Get scissors and trim it up. All right, now you have two. Like that. Okay. All right. Okay. Now you're gonna wanna totally wrap these in duct tape. Let's put up this knife. Now you're going to totally wrap these in duct tape. So what I mean by that, get your duct tape, and just get, oh, sometimes this duct tape is not all right. Oh, wait there. Okay. And now some duct tape. And now, sorry, I'm trying to put them around my camera. Like that, radius and size. Just so you can put these two together, and then you can do detail. Alright, it's pretty decent size. I'm gonna get the two cardboard pieces that you have and put them together like this. Just so they can stay together. Okay. Get it all together. And now I'm gonna wanna do details. So um, we're gonna do over here, here, basically so this whole whole thing is color covered in your duct tape. Start ripping it. Get it done. And go like this. <sighs> Alright, like this. And I pull it like this and just wrap it over. Get a little piece and do it around here. Just make sure we're covering this whole thing. Because if you are going to use this in battle, you want it to be durable. So, and if you have little things like this, and I don't think it looks good, you can just cut them off. I ain't going to do a big deal. Alright, and now we're going to get the top part. the back part. Another strand of duct tape. Okay. Here's the duct tape. I'm going to go like this. Tape it again because mine kind of chopped in half, I guess. There. Okay. Now it's all. Okay. This is also um, bulletproof duct tape. Um, is uh, airsoft proof, not real bulletproof, but. When I say bulletproof on the videos, I'll mean airsoft. Right, now that that's done, you want to take your magazine and um, make sure it fits. Okay, and then get your other one. Right. I like about these AK Max is they have these parts. They can just like kind of lock it in there. Okay, and then you're going to take your other one. Fits right on. Okay, but first, once you're going to do the first magazine, is once you get it on there. <laughs> Get a pretty long size of duct tape. And 
the lower bit. God, I hate duct tape sometimes. Okay, there, like this, and then just want to put it on, but make sure you get in all the wedges and stuff. And I'll just get it on there. That's what I'm saying, is on the other side of the Get in all these grooves. Like that. Now I'm going to fold this one over. Okay, pretty much working. Okay. All right. Yeah, I kind of have to rearrange it. Okay, stuck to me now. It's like that. So I'm gonna tape it again because. I'm just gonna do a little bit better taping this time. Okay, this, 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 and this. Okay, I'm gonna do it right here just to get it all folded on. Okay. Alrighty. I'm gonna put it on. Yeah. Okay, it's holding. Oh, I was watching Arthur Christmas. I saw that movie a couple of days ago. It really wasn't that good, I must say. You know, I haven't even seen a movie for so long. Okay, that one you know it's pretty good spaced out. It should look like that. So it's, at least shove your finger in there. Yeah, that's what she said. Okay, so now I'm going to tape it around like this. I'm gonna get my foot to hold it. Yeah. No, oh, your truck. Man, I, I guess whenever I get the color tuck tape, it just does not like me. It has to do with stuff like this. It's like, really? Really? Don't even get me started on the clear duct tape. Not the uh, scotch tape, but. The other one just doesn't even. Well, also, there's no grooves in it. Then there's all this. I just ripped off and threw it away. Cause I actually have to get it straight for this to hold. Should be about good. Okay. Stick it on my pant leg and rip it. Okay. Uh -huh. That's bonding together. That's good. I'm gonna do it here. Now also, you want to make sure you don't tape it on the bottom because if you have a wind-up clip, make sure you can still wind them. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. You can like wind them both at one time. That's awesome. Okay. One more big piece, piece of duct tape. That's all done. Well, then you gotta turn on your gun to make sure it works. Okay. This. Wrapping it around so I do a bond. 
And, um, I might have some Minecraft. Well, it's not really Minecraft. It's called Total Miner. It's on the Xbox. And it's not a game, but you can buy it from the arcade for 320 Microsoft points. And I bought it. And it's basically like Minecraft, except there's no night, no monsters, and it's, um, pretty fun. Uh, yeah, okay. This isn't exactly straight. If you really wanted to, you could do cardboard this whole thing. Just to get it perfect. See how, like, mine's, like, one's tilted. This one's tilting, so I'm trying to get it separated. Okay, so it's just... That's pretty nice. Like, you need to this. I like that. It might wave around a little bit, but... You like the pew pew pew. Pew 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 pew. And you can just go like this. Put it on the other one. And talk to it. And keep shouting. It's pretty nice because now I can run around with 600 bullets. Or you can also just get one of the big drum. Um, drum magazines or box magazines. It depends if you're getting M4. AK. I'm an M4 guy, but I. I this is my first rifle, so. I still like it. So yeah, um, we will see you guys later. Um, I will hopefully have some uh, videos of me with my new um, Mossberg M500 Persuader, I think. Um, shotgun, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna go to my friend's house later today and I'm sleeping over there and we're gonna be, um, he has a pool so we're gonna be like jumping in with airsoft spring rifles and it's gonna be a lot of fun. So, uh, check that out. So, watch the version 2 of this. Hopefully I'll make it. See you guys later.